I thought was gone and Oh, shoot.
interesting I'm hoping for some big perch bobber's down now this time hey, it's down hey, see that the bobber's down I reel Going down, but then it pops right back up. Oh, come on. Valerie Vaughn. The line gets caught in weeds and stuff, it makes it so hard to get the tension up before the fish is gone. Shoot! settles down inside in the weeds and then can't get the tension up to set the hook. Uh oh, now oh, there went my minnow. Shoot. Fish probably got my mineral, I just threw off. pressure that's pulling against the there we go finally what do we got hopefully he didn't just I think he just grabbed oh he didn't better size Norman than the last one. <laughs> not, still not too big.
That's exactly what I wanted. Don't swallow it, but hopefully. Come on. Just enough to get it out. Don't want to hurt him too much. That's, he's got it like right in his throat, and I don't want to. Exactly what I wanted. Same fighting right here. Oh, another beauty. Perfect. Oh, did he swallow it completely? Nope. Oh, something big just jumped behind me. one of the bigger ones or something but you have a smack at it. Yep. <laughs> yeah. yeah, see that's the problem. It's so small they grab onto the end of the worm and I don't <laughs> Wasn't ready for that. Yeah, another, another sunfish. Yeah, yellow. That these are my favorites of the for the pond because they're really pretty. But I've already got quite a few. In the pond. Whoops.
Oops. Oh, see, I'm working so hard on making so they don't swallow it. They did. Dragging it. It was dragging it. I thought it was dragging it long enough. I just didn't. Granddaddy perch would be nice. Like a 12 incher. Oh, bluegills hitting at that minnow on, or that there's a bug that's been flopping around on the surface right there. Right out there is a bluegill just hit at it. head in pretty quick here to make sure they stay go living. Yep, Bluegill got that bug. Go to waste, we'll use it for pond food. <laughs> 